Thousands of people are getting ready to raise money for ovarian cancer research. They will do so by walking or running at the annual Home Teal Strides for Ovarian Cancer. That fundraiser is a week from this Saturday in Edina. And joining us, we have Mary Pat Oslin. She is a survivor of ovarian cancer, and she's also president of the MOCA board. And MOCA, in case you didn't know, stands for Minnesota Ovarian Cancer Alliance. Thanks so much for coming in. Yeah, thanks for having me. 13 years strong. Yes, yes, very lucky. Congratulations. What? Thank you, I appreciate it. And why is it so important to you to give back now? Well, it's hugely important because, first of all, um, there is no detection test for ovarian cancer. So I was diagnosed really early, but that's pretty rare. Unfortunately, 80% of the women are diagnosed in the late stages of the disease, and it's because we have no detection test. So I got involved with MOCA because MOCA's mission is to try to find a detection test and, of course, to also support uh, women and families affected by this disease. And MOCA does just fantastic work when it comes to fundraising, $7 million uh, that they've been able to give towards researchers, many of those projects right here in Minnesota, uh, and that is to find this early detection test. I know some of those researchers are going to be speaking at the event. Yes, and so this event we're talking about is the Home Till Strides event, September 16th. So put it on your calendar, September 16th, uh, 16th in Roslyn Park in Edina. It's a really, really fun event. There's a 5K a run, a 2K walk, and a kids fun run. So super fun event, really inspiring. I really encourage people to come out, come out and listen to these researchers. Yes. 3,500 people. It's like a sea of teal. It's super fun. My family, we go every year. My mom's a survivor as well. I'm going to be emceeing this year. It is such a powerful day. Not only is it uplifting and celebratory, but it can also be pretty somber for some of the people and families yes. who are there. Yes, it can be. And when you listen to, we always have some of the doctors come up and talk, and uh, it's really meaningful for the survivors. It's um, it's very touching because they're right there with the battle with the women, and um, it's just really nice to have their support. And they come up for this big event, so it's really fun. And for people who have been before or maybe they're newcomers, you guys kind of have a new course for the 5K and the 2K. Yes, thank you. Yes, we're kind of rerouting people a little bit this year. There's going to be a little bit more room. Um, it will be not be as a tight of a course. And then what's really fun is that we're going to have music on the course. There's going to be a live band. There's going to be lawn games. So we're, we're trying to just really add the fun festival feel to it. Awesome. Hi. I love it. Well, there's still time to sign up online. Home Teal Strides for Ovarian Cancer is Saturday, September 16th at Roseland Park in Edina. The 5K starts at 9.15 a.m. The 2K walk is at 9.45. And you can find that link to register at wcco.com slash links. Mary Pat, thanks so much for coming yeah, in. Yeah, thanks for having me.